You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week, and I'm back after a short while, actually. I've been actually been waiting with of the latest release of the Bleem Sync. Um, but since it's still not out, might as well just try the latest emulator core that came out, and that's for PSP. So yes, you can play PSP games on your uh, PlayStation Classic. So let's see how it goes. Let's give it a try. And I loaded two games here on my um, thumb drive. Let's try Castlevania Dracula X Chronicles. Let's see how it goes. Okay. All right. Looks promising. Um, yeah, of course, except. And um, Konami logo, yes. As if we needed another excuse to play this game. It's a definite classic. A remaster, not really a remaster, but a compilation just came out for the PS4 uh, just a few months ago. And looks like it tanged already. We're stuck in a black screen. Pressing buttons, nothing's happening. 29.3 frames per second. Let's see if I could get out of this. Oh, okay. Well, at least I was able to get out. Uh, so, I don't know. Maybe did I exit too fast? Or was it really not working? Anyway, might as well try another game. And this is Gundam vs. Gundam, Next Plus. And um, if you've seen my other videos, you'll know I'm a big fan of um, Super Robot Mecha Shows. But Gundam isn't really a Super Robot, but I might as well include it since they're usually part of the Super Robot Wars. Okay, this one looks promising. At least something's happening. Okay, it's asking me for my name. And my name is usually A A A. Yes. Oh no, made a mistake. There. No. Ah, oh, this is the problem if you can't really read Japanese that much just a little it boils down to trial and error okay this one went further than um, how Castlevania went through earlier so I'll have to try the Castlevania again maybe it's just a bad copy I don't know All right. So for those who don't know, this is uh, like a two on two matches between various uh, Gundam units from various Gundam shows. I mean. It's really a mix. All right, free battle. All right, let's see here. Gundam, gun cannon, gun tank. Um, Charles Zaku, Dom, um, Akgai, Zera Gundam, Gundam Mark Two, Gundam Mark. To the different color <laughs> version of Camille, Kubele, Hakushiki, Double Zeta Gundam, Kubele Mark II, um, I um, forgot this thing's name, <laughs> sorry, uh, the other Kubele, it's different color, New Gundam, Sazabi, F91, I forgot the name, V2, I also forgot the name. Man, I forgot. It's been a while. 
<laughs> so I forgot most of these things name. God Gundam, Master Gundam, Shining Gundam, Nobel Gundam, Spiegel Gundam, Gundam Zero, Wing Zero, I'm sorry. That's Scythe Hell, Heavy Arms Custom, that's this, uh, Epion, Tall Geese, Zero Gundam, Wing Zero, Shenron, uh, Double X, Gundam X, something I forgot, Turn A, <laughs> Turn X, uh, Carpool, Freedom, Strike, Aegis, uh, something, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I've really forgotten already, it's been a while, Destiny Gundam, um, Impulse, Strike Freedom, At Akatsuki, uh, this is Zaku Custom, uh, what's this? I know the pilot's name is Chris Christina McKenzie. <laughs> um, GP01, GP02, GP03, Z8, Ground Type Gundam. Oh wow, I can't remember the double O units. Unicorn. Alright, well that was my attempt to name all the units I can actually remember. Unfortunately, there's not a lot. I've completely forgotten. Alright. So, yeah. This is usually a two-on-two -two thing. It's based from an arcade game. An arcade series at least. And... Okay, the audio is terrible. So, unfortunately, it, uh, without the audio, a lot is taken out from the experience. As you can hear, barely hear, that it's actually based from the the theme songs of the Gundam shows and right now we're hearing the one from the original so while it actually looks good um, That's just about it. Its um, performance is very terrible. I mean, it's laggy. And we're losing already. And the audio is stuttering. It's terrible. Mm. Well, I don't know, guys. Maybe um, core update soon? Hopefully, or I probably need to tweak some settings. I'm not familiar with it yet. This is actually really the first time I'm trying the PSP core for the retro arc. So at some points, the sound is okay like earlier on the character selection screen but on the actual gameplay yep it doesn't look good it doesn't sound good I mean Well, um, I guess that's it for this uh, video. Um, I'll see if I can find more ISOs to try for PSP. Uh, 
hopefully we get something playable than this one as um for you guys wondering if uh, these are playable yeah I wouldn't bother right now at least maybe soon but right now yeah it's terrible anyway uh, that's it for this video you're watching 8-bit days a week thanks for watching please do like comment and subscribe and um, see you soon <laughs>